All right, Matt, we'll check back in. Would you shave your hair in support of any medical cause? I'm not sure if it's something everyone would do, but that's okay because every single year LSU health students host their go bald fundraiser where we get super low haircuts in front of a crowd while raising money for a good cause. All right, KSLA News tells Michael Barnes is live in our courtyard where he is joined by some brave students who are ready to give up their luscious locks for a good cause. And Michael, they raised somewhere in the amount of $50,000 some years. Yes, good morning, Dominique. Yes, they've raised that much money over the many years that they've been doing it. And brave is an understatement. When you're talking about dozens of LSU health students all ready to cut it off in the name of pediatric cancer care research. And today with me, I have Kelly Broussard, and Ray Oler joining me to talk a little bit about Go Bald. But first, I'm going to ask you, are you guys shaving it off today? <laughs> um, probably not. I'm a little attached to all this, uh, so I don't think it's going anywhere today. You do have really nice hair. <laughs> you do have really nice hair, but um, so I understand not wanting to cut it off. I'm not doing that either. But <laughs> one of you tell me, what, what is Go Bald? Tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, so Go Bald is a student-run organization at LSU Health uh, Medical School. That's been going for about 11 years now. We've raised over a half a million dollars in, since then. Um, and we just do small organization uh, fundraisers throughout the year to raise money for St. Baldrick's, which uh, funds cancer research for kids. Absolutely, and then I do know that there have been some first year efforts um, happening for the first time, um, I believe last year, that are helping with this fundraiser. Yeah, so uh, in the beginning of this year, uh, I really want to start a new event where we could bring in um, medical students and also doctors and uh, natives to Shreveport and make a really big event to support Go Bald. And so we started the Go Bald Gala. It was at the Remington in November. Um, we had a band, catering, silent auction, and it was really great. And it blew our expectations out of the water. We ended up raising $33,000 in one night, which was crazy. Wow, $33,000 in one night, and they still have much more money to raise. That's absolutely amazing. Kelly, tell me about some of the uh, raffles that you've been driving around town gathering for people to buy to help raise some more money. For sure, so I'm the VP of Community Fundraising, so my job is to recruit other students as well as myself, going out in the community and asking some of our local businesses to either donate money or in-kind donations for us to raffle today at Shave Day in the BRI atrium of LSU Health Shreveport. Um, we have multiple restaurant gift cards, some spa gift cards, as well as nails. And we also have a signed mud bug hockey stick, so be on the lookout for that. <laughs> signed mud bugs hockey stick, all my savings going towards <laughs> that. Um, if any of you guys want to try to beat me on that, you can check out our KSLA News 12 app or website where we'll have raffle information. If you just want to donate, we'll have information about that too. That event will be today at noon until three o'clock on the LSU Health campus. And we're live in the KSLA Courtyard. Michael Barnes, KSLA News 12.